Hello, friends and fans, and welcome back to Let's Play Geopolitical Simulator Pound Revolution 2019, Episode 9 of our Sweden Let's Play. Uh, we finally got a little bit of dirt going on, so I'm just going to go ahead and get right into it. This Prime Minister, I have proof that Norwegian government secretly finances Kuwait Shiite resistance forces terrorizes terrorists to attack Kuwait. I have already communicated this information to your Secret Service, and they have recorded it in your files. A crunchy revolution that is. Revelation. I don't know why I said revolution. <laughs> that is worthy of these small premiums which you favor those who serve your enthusiasm, right? Oh, all that? Thank you, Prime Minister. My pleasure. All right, we got some dirt. Got some international festival. I don't think it's going to be enough to go to war, but we'll see. So let's go ahead and go to the UN. Uh, provide a name. I proof. All right, so there. We're going to send that over to the UN and say, hey, always like supporting terrorists down here in Kuwait. Not cool, man. Not cool. There might be enough warrant for sanctions, but I don't know if, if I can get military justification, then, you know, hopefully. Oh, and um, while I was off camera, our agents did set up in North Korea. So there's that going on. We also have agents set up in Cuba. And with the clock ticking, let's go ahead and see what we can do here. Service. So they don't get caught. I'm going to up their training on political a little bit. Maybe like one more star. There. Because we got money from all those trade deals, so be okay. I need them to be able to get me that crap like real fast, real fast. Alrighty, let's see what else do we have here? Minister for Education it discovers a lot of shit. Roland Broshton's trial. It's done, Prime Minister of the Court condemned. Yeah, well, it's okay. Damn anti racist. So if you're an anti racist, your politics are on the right track. Does that actually make you a racist? Or, uh, or you're just against racism? <laughs> I guess. But racism is just human nature sometimes. And you just, this happens. Even to some of the best people. They will find some way to talk about race. It's like, a, since we're playing a little political game, here, here's my viewpoint on racism. I believe. Racism isn't exactly a direct form of attacking or insulting someone based on their race. I think that you can have, I think that you could actually be a racist because if you go to someone, let's say of a dish, different color of you and you're like, oh, your people are oppressed and you're this and you're that, you're already basically being a racist because you're making claims on a person based on their race, when that person may be not even have those circumstances at all. So I believe anybody who actually continues to bring up race is actually not like a hateful racist, but like a, uh, a <laughs> I don't know how to put it. I'm just going to leave it at that. Not like a full on racist, but you know, you keep bringing up the issue about the person's race rather than who they actually are. So that's my two cents on things. Back to the game. <laughs> uh, I'm probably going to get flagged for YouTube on that one. You're like, oh my god, he talked about this. And blah, 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 blah. Like, please don't strike me down, YouTube. Don't strike me down with all of your things. <laughs> uh, okay. Got How's our... Here, let, you know, let, here let, let's do this. Let's go ahead and make... We lowered that. USA was renegotiated, so that's down to 4.24. Did that go back up? I could have strongly dropped it down to 4.2. What the fuck? Oh, no, no, yeah, it was the previous rate on 4.2. So, and we dropped that down. So we can get France down a little bit, huh? Keep working on lowering our interest rates. Hey. New entry, Sweden accuses their right. Okay, here we go. Prime 
Prime Minister, out of your request, we admit that the evidence that you brought to our is significantly stronger. To All right, yes, that's what we wanted. All right. I want military no, not against the terrorist wait how come what the hell how come it's not on here I don't want a terrorist army it, it's not wow are you serious I can't even request oh there we go I was like where is it where is the military intervention? Oh, right. France, uh, where were you at? Budget. You were at, you were at like 0.77. It went up a percent. All right, let's drop you down to 0.5. Sure. I'd be happy. You're not. Very well. What kind of offer do you wish to make us? 7.5.75. Very well. Very good. <laughs> I'm going to feel the United States coffers. Cars. All right, well, let's see here. How's our, how's our research? Building They're actually understood like okay. Maybe you guys can leave me in the comments and actually tell me exactly how I'm supposed to uh build. Oh, we don't even have rocket engines. Tell me how to build electric cars, because I have like no idea. Human, AI, astronaut. Under IT. So we're still researching all this. W223 in 2024. E paper, RFID chips. Little mark of the beast right there we have it yes we do we do have the beast <laughs> echo full medicate and environment maybe it's under here carbon nanofibers cold fusion dna transmission high power fuel battery construction of electric oh okay here we go so we need this research 22 between 22 and 23 well lady it's going to be about three more years <laughs> Mr. Hockey Key brings in the government. The Mr. Help out blunder after blunder and they start damage credibility. <clears throat> well, okay, maybe I'll ask uh, a doctor if he wants to be that one. Well, this one is energy and environment. I wonder if I pump more money into energy and environment, which is basically almost full. So maybe. Instead of that, maybe I should just build some more research centers. That'll cost me, uh oh, we got a meeting. Any requests with somebody? I am missing all this crap right here. Our governmental cell informs me that it has had the opportunity to. Okay, good. Our governmental cell informs me that it has. So Cuba and Finland. Our governmental cell informs me. Norway are now in play. Settle the EU stability pact. Uh, we'll build four more research centers across dispute just over the whole territory. Five months to complete. Cost over. I don't even know if I can even afford that. Here, we'll do three. <laughs> Prime Minister for Health. Why are you messing up Prime Minister for Health? Cabinet.
He's at 100%. You're doing so bad, that's wrong. I wish they would tell you, like, it's like, okay, well, he's doing this and this and this, not just, oh, he's making blunders and making us look bad. It's like, um, okay. <laughs> like, like, what's he doing exactly? I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what you're talking about. He says he's 100%, so why would I replace him? He loves me. Everything's on fire, 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 fire. Bombing in Pakistan. The voice it's Sunday the twenty first. Government is in the streets. Let's help them stay clean. Stated. Okay. That's weird. Alrighty, let's see what else we can do here. Hmm. the elections coming up. Programs. Happiness declines in Sweden. Oh, narrow. Well, that's one thing we could do. What's our happiness lacking? Purchasing power, employment, and education. Mm -hmm. All right, they're proceeding with the request. This might be it. May get shot down. I don't know. I may go to war anyway, even if they don't like it. <laughs> hey, I may do it. <laughs> You're committed. Need to start like getting some. What do you want, lady? Good morning. I did. Iceland. You want to sell me chicken for one million dollars, but I don't need chicken. I have like a shitload of chicken. <laughs> My production is like through the roof. So, um, sorry, Iceland, but I don't need chicken. <laughs> sorry, do not need your chicken. <laughs> Don't need the poil. All right, I gotta start getting myself some friendly, friendly uh, people here. One thing I have been lacking in doing is the state governments, government party figures, other parties. Center left ecologist. Mm. I mean, they're all pretty friendly with me, so let's see. Who can I Cuba network on for rejected? $3 billion cash surplus, very good. Who is actually. What party are we? I don't even know what fucking party I am. Political Party, Workers' Party for Socialism, or the Rose. We are the Rose. Let's see here. So, Parliament. That's us right here. So, we have the majority of the left. I'm sure, the progressive fronts are pretty much with us. Go ahead and set up a meeting with them. Try and get some of these groups over Swedish Union for convergence. Yeah, let's try and get some of these uh, central groups with us. And let's we'll see the Christian. Yeah, they're. You know, the Democratic right. Yeah, they're kind of like indifferent. 
Okay, I'm definitely not going to get the far right. That's for damn sure. The community research data transmits making progress. Prime Minister, we have perfected our own production system for fiber optics, whose delivery is incomparable with traditional coax that currently up our telecommunications networks. You're not the first, but we can profit a lot from this. Uh, sure. Why not? We'll make our fiber optics unique to the world. Oh, wait, that means that we could build communications. Uh, or would it be energy service? Would it be service? Internet services. There we go. Oh, that's for that. No, never mind. I don't need taking care of ecology. No, thanks. I'd be happy. You're going to make. No. Professor's front secretary general. Well, that's okay. Even the meeting will boost me up with them a little bit. Oh, let's see here. The media. Oh, there we go. So it would be under media. How much would this cost me? Oh, that's not that much. I can get 50%. Is that right now 90? Get that up to 92. That one up to 80. There. I'd be happy. Thanks. That's really. There we go. Okay. Uh, what was it we needed to improve on again? I believe it was purchasing power, employment, and education's going up. So just purchasing power and employment. So we can do something here. Go ahead and go to our friend here. Oh, no. <laughs> Not that much. I'll raise it up 35 there. And then we'll go ahead and take that and go to civil servant and everybody a little bit of extra money. All right. And work. I'd be happy. Thanks. That's no problem. Uh, work, work, checks. Receive payment, help for employing seniors. For employing young people, we'll go ahead and boost that up. Oh, we have employment agencies a little. Never mind, you are too expensive. What are you guys complaining? <laughs> Sit in against the government policy, Pacific Past Fizzing members just gathered. Are concluded. Sure. Huh. Yes. 
Yes. I'm sorry, but. Aww. Damn it. Your television appearance was very well received by the demonstration. I don't know what the hell they're protesting about. Like, I didn't even do anything. <laughs> like, hey, everyone, let's just have a random protest. Yeah, go for it. Like, I'm improving your internet. That's off to you. The decreased salary is admirable. Like, I'm improving your guys' internet. I'm improving, like... Like, what does the pacifist have to do? Like, they did it after I did the freaking work thing. Like, what does that have to do with anything? They gave you guys, like, better things. I don't know. Last time I tried to do this off-camera, and that just, like, completely fucking... It, it, it's weird the way this country works. It's like you try and, like, make things better, and it backfires on you. Like I tested something off camera, I established like, okay, you know, here, there's some help for, you know, establishing um, wages and everything like that. And it was better than what it was set up initially. And so nobody cares. <laughs> no one voted on it. They all abstained. They're like, mm, yeah, we don't really care. All right, so, all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and save it right here. Just in case. <laughs> Uh, okay, guys, so. Hey, why the hell do I have you in sanctions? I don't know, the tripping. Um, so I try this is actually a re-edit guys um like i said i would save it i saved it first just to see and yeah declaring war on norway even though without the approval of the un basically i dropped to zero and i was removed from office in a heartbeat before we even managed to take the city before my troops even fucking got into the city The only thing I can do, and of course, is I have two options, and I'll leave it to you guys up in the comments, is I don't think a full-blown war is going to be capable, at least with this. So what we can do is I can do a commando rush. Now, I know some people don't like that. They like to see the full-blown battle. But if I do the full-blown battle, I lose the game. So if I do a commando rush, take their city before they even realize what happened, and then before NATO, before the UN has a chance to react, you know, and that'll be that'll be the end of it. Norway, Finland, or we can wait. We can keep doing some other episodes, and hopefully, maybe by the time that happens, I'll be able to get more justification towards either North Korea and or Cuba in that time. But for right now, yeah, I definitely cannot just straight up go to war with uh, either one of these countries. Otherwise, I will definitely lose the game. Like, it didn't even take two. Why am I getting UN sanctions? Why? What the hell is going on with that? It doesn't even say I have any sanctions. It says none, so I don't know what the hell is going on. But anyway, yeah, so that's going to be that. I am dreadfully sorry. I tried. But either that or maybe we just need more more concrete evidence against Norway. Like I said, it's very, very 
part to try and take over the European countries that you are definitely a part of. I said in a Supreme Ruler, it's a little bit more easier because I could just fund the opposition. I don't I mean I could try and destabilize them, but I don't think that would really do any good. It would just end up costing more than what it's worth. So I'll let you guys decide that in the comments. So please be sure to let me know. <clears throat> but in any case, I am going to go ahead and end the episode here. So thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Check out my partner channels in the links in the description below. And I will see you all in the next one. Stay safe out there and stay swagged.